Yes, yes, it's been a while. Everyone knows. Ah, where was I? Ah, yes. Two unlikely versions of one impossible story. The Hyperion salaryman who stumbled across the perfect plan to defeat his rival. But bad things can happen when you swim against fate. Hijacking the secret purchase of the ultimate prize, a vault key. Finding co-conspirators was easy. Finding real vault keys, never is. Then there's the Pandoran Hustler, who conspired to sell a fake vault key. But unfortunately, plans don't often go, you know, as planned. A bullet saved is a bullet earned. And now, they were stuck with each other, with nothing to gamble but their lives. So, they prepared to face psychos, warlords, even vault hunters. For betrayal, no one is prepared for betrayal. He didn't think she would shoot, but she did. The money was gone, but the path to a vault key was right under their feet. Below the arena, they found the Gortis Project. Atlas's crown jewel, along with a lost king, looking to regain his throne. I'm up. Hey! I'm up. Seriously, can you use your words? <sighs> You're just wasting bullets with that thing. Mm, yeah, okay. Ah, oh, come on, you drooled on me! Huh? Oh, yeah, that's a. Wow, that's a lot. I am feeling a little dehydrated. <laughs> God, what is wrong with you? There. Now we're even. You are a monster! Stop! I'm gonna let you out of those restraints. Don't make me regret it, because you'll regret it much more. Mm -hmm. Sure, yeah, okay. Yeah, we, that works for me. Let's do that. We've got a long way to go. We should move before the sun's up. Uh, can I please hit him once? Just to get it out of my system. You gotta work on your anger management. All this animosity is not good for- Just one. What? Huh? <laughs> Okay, I'm good. You punched me in the neck. Let's go. Now, where were we? Well... What is it? Reese, buddy, you uh, you all right? Hey, Reese, what is your problem? He gets uh, headaches sometimes. Uh, probably just a glitch in his wiring. He's all right. He, you know, just probably needs some air. So, uh, upstairs where there's more air because it's higher and. Hey, what's up with that map? Computer enhance. 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 Enhance computer images. Stop it! This is not how computers work. Where are you from? You you don't just yell enhance at the screen. Maybe I can bring up a legend on this thing. Ah! 
I'm okay. Did you break it? Go ahead, Fiona. Uh, pick it up. Fiona. I don't understand. You and Reese are the only ones that didn't shock. Maybe they're somehow imprinted on you. Vintage Atlas. Uh, incredible! Retinal scanner online. Security protocol engaged. Retinal scan required. Please step forward and identify yourself. Uh, maybe we should get out while we have the chance. Just waiting on you. Please step forward and identify yourself. Guess I should have known it'd go like this. What's taking so long? Someone in there. I mean, someone. Who is it? Are they alive? No idea who it is, but they are very much not alive. Oh, craps. That's probably not... Wait. You hear that? Sounds like this General Pollux never made it out of the room. Well, that's... creepy. Yeah, okay. Yeah, that's exactly what I thought I was gonna see. Well, now all we have to do is get his eye to that retinal scanner. Well, maybe we can just scoot him over to the computer. Wedged in there pretty tight. Now what? Well, it's a retina scanner, right? We don't actually need all of him for that. Ooh, how much he got? Not that much. Now you'd think a general would have more walking around money on him. His uniform. Atlas military, high ranking at that. His eyes are pretty creepy. You're basically doing him a favor. I'm not sure he would agree. If you try to rip it out with your bare hand, you'll just end up squishing it. Uh, if you have a better idea. Any other idea would be a better idea! Ugh. That guy's got some creepy eyes. I don't like them. They do kind of follow you around the room, don't they? Hey, 
Hey, it's a spoon and a fork! Ha! How about that? Oh, wait, that's not... Yep. The eye's gotta come out one way or another. Okay, this is... Okay. Yeah, yeah, you, you gotta do it. I, I gotta do it. I gotta do it, so I just... Just shove that into his face. Why do you have to say it like that? I'm just saying. Did you just do it already? Okay! Mm. Ah! Why did that just happen? Oh, man. You split the eye right in half. All the juice from the thing. Ugh. Why are you describing it to me? I know. I did it. Right. Sorry. Look, all I'm saying is, you got one more shot. Right, because he's got two eyes. One eye, now. You've got a knack for numbers, don't you? I'll just wait over there. Here we go. Right, so far so good. Stop talking to me. Ooh. I can't tell if that's looking better or looking worse. It's looking way worse. Trust me. If you're gonna puke, do it on the floor, please. This is me helping. Ooh! Ugh! You almost... you almost got it. Just... cut the thing. Holding it to the... the thing. Whoa! I got it! Thank you. Hey! And you didn't crush it. I totally would have crushed it. Let's just get this thing over to the scanner. Which makes it the perfect place to hide a Gordis project. Whatever that is. Message to General Pollock's memorandum. If you're watching this, then I'm already in suspended animation. You must understand, Athena was trying to kill me. And what I possess is far too powerful to end up in the arsenal of a ruthless mercenary. If Athena is no longer a threat. Please activate the revival protocol in my stasis dock. My life and quite possibly the fate of the universe is in your hands. Oh no. Does that mean he was oh when you scooped oh ah. No way. No. No, he had to be dead when we <sighs> don't. Just don't. So, I guess we're going to Old Haven. Reese, you want to take a look at the... <laughs> oh, ouch. I'm fine. Stay put. Coming up. No, oh, no need. No need. I'll be right down. Oh! Wait, what? hit my head what are you talking about i saw you hit that girder no no no, no. I, I i hit my head on that but i didn't hit my head when i fell on the computers and obviously there wasn't a geyser of blood 
There was quite a bit of blood. This is all fascinating, very thorough. But what about Jack? Oh, right. Jack. This, ladies and gentlemen, is the Gordis Project. And it's gonna lead us to a vault. And then I'll probably kill you. <laughs> what? Okay, here's what's gonna happen. You, uh, sorry, uh, what's your name again? Come on, spit it out, dum-dum. I don't have all day. I, uh... Oh, good. <laughs> you work for me. I thought, I thought I was gonna have to get violent there for a second. Or more violent. Come on, time's a waste. Turrets, no automated defenses. <laughs> it's, it's like Atlas is just begging us to take it. Come on, Cupcake, what's the holdup? Get over here! Yeah, I know, I'm your hero, you're my biggest fan, blah, blah, blah. Welcome to the club. Just try to sweat yourself, kid. You might short yourself to death. All right, take notes, kiddo. I'm not one to repeat myself. Our first step is secure the area. Not enough to attract bandits, just enough to keep out the gawkers. Oh, uh, then we're gonna need a drop ship to get this tech out of here. Jack, what? No, this is impossible. Jack, you're... You're dead. Uh, I'm dead? I'm sorry, what's that supposed to mean? Are you threatening me, little man? What? No, 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 no! Why did that just happen? Oh, oh shut up! Are you screaming because you're in pain, or are you just freaking out because this is really weird? Because it, it is... it is weird. Would you please stop doing that? This is... this doesn't make any sense. Stand still, damn it! Stop doing that! It's like I told you. Handsome Jack is dead. No, 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 no. That's impossible. I, I can't die. It's the, no, no, that's no, stupid. No way. Oof. Never had to tell someone they died before, so... Uh, sorry? That must suck. Uh, heroes don't die. <laughs> uh, especially not... Before the story gets to the good part, this doesn't make any sense. No, 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 no. I'm, I'm, I'm handsome, Jack. <laughs> I don't die. Hey, there's too much left to do. I'm not, not having it. Not happening. Hey, come here, cupcake. Just let me try to rip your throat out one more time. Just one more time. Come here. What? No, no. Ah, uh, you see, I think I just gotta be quicker about it. That's what it is. Stand still, damn it. Hey, hey. Come on, stop it. You're just wasting your time. Oh, I'll be the judge of that. <laughs> You're so stupid. Watch your head do me. Stay put. I'm coming up. Oh! Freeze! So much pain. Why am I still conscious? I don't understand. Reese, hey. You all right? What the hell are you doing? You're acting... strange. I... I know that sounds weird, but... I just... I just saw Handsome Jack. What are you saying? Handsome Jack, he was... he was next to me. Right. Okay. Well, you had quite a spill there. Let's just get you up off this thing. Here you go. You know, these fumes can't possibly be helping. Pretty out of it. I'm seeing stars. Shooting stars. Moonshots. Moonshots? Really? Moonshots? We need to get out of here! The Loderbot! The Loderbot, hey!
Thanks. Get in! We gotta go! Why is Hyperion trying to kill us? Don't you work for those guys? I'll file a complaint with HR when we get back. But we have to not die right now! Boost getting out of there! How long till it recharges? A few minutes at least. Give me the wheel. What? Why? Uh, I'm not hearing a good reason. I can dodge the moonshots. That's impossible. Not if I know where they're gonna land. Then what? <laughs> we'll go to Hollow Point. They can't track us there. You better know what you're doing. Okay, here's what we're gonna do. Just keep us alive until that thing is full and then we can boost out of here. Got it? Yeah, I got it. I got it. I don't got it! <laughs> Where the hell did they come from? I'm saying this, Fiona, help! Fiona! Hey, 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 what are you guys doing? What's it look like?
I can, but it's chaos up here. So I can't talk long. <sighs> we could use some wheels. Vasquez's car is long gone. Oh, and we're stranded out here in the desert. Look, I'm able to track you, so stay safe for now. I'll send what I can. Cool. Hopefully she can help us out. We can't be walking through the desert too long. I mean, not without water. To go through all this and die of dehydration would be pretty lame. Uh, fun? We should get you to a vet. What? Why? What's happening? Because those pythons look sick. Huh? Your arms are... I... I don't... You are weirdly buff, dude. That's what I'm... I put an exercise bike in my office a few months ago. Don't worry about it. Right. He is pretty young. <laughs> I gotta say, I'm a little envious of the definition he's got going. He's saving the world. It doesn't leave you much time for the gym. Did you stop sneaking up on me? <sighs> who's sneaking? I don't sneak. Oh, so you've been here this whole time? Yeah. Oh. Reese, who are you talking to? So he definitely can't see me, right? You're kind of freaking me out, Reese. We're the only ones here. Hey, so remember earlier when uh, I said I could see Handsome Jack? Sure, right after you fell off the ledge. <laughs> oh, yeah, right. Well, it's true. Uh, he's standing right next to you. Right. Right. So, Handsome... <laughs> handsome Jack is standing next to me. Yes. And I can't see him, but you're able to see him and also talk to him. Correct. He definitely thinks you're crazy. Who exactly is this little muscle-bound tool? Yvonne, you believe me, right? Oh, Reese, I'm late for my tea time. Shut up. No, no, not, not you. Sorry. <sighs> okay. Ask him how many fingers I'm holding up. Oh, I don't know. He's scratching his ass, and, uh... Oh! God, I think he may have pissed on his shirt. That's not yeah, clean. How many? Three. Three. You're holding up three fingers. Lucky guess. You know it's not. Come on. We should get out of the sun. I... I don't understand. <laughs> Join, Join the, the club. club. Jinx. Let's go. I can't tell if I'm crazy or you're crazy. Yeah, I don't know what state of being uh, I'm in right now, but uh, well, walking still sucks. Man, what are the odds? What does he mean? Yeah, what do you mean? Well, I mean, of all the people in the universe, Handsome Jack could be appearing to. It just happens to be the guy who's totally obsessed with him. <laughs> I mean, it's crazy! It's like destiny. Uh, what? Should I be creeped out right now? Because I'm feeling a little creeped out. <laughs> what? No, I wouldn't say I'm, you know, obsessed. I admire his work, sure, but I mean, obsessed? That's a, that's a, that's a strong way to describe it. All right, take it, it down a couple of notches, kiddo. I'm really digging how you're looking at me right now. I'm not sure it is. I mean, think about it. You got all those handsome Jack posters in your office, dude. I think that's a little weird. That makes two of us. Yeah, those are motivational posters. You let the cat hang it. They're Hyperion issued. Well, maybe it has something to do with the Nakayama drive. Namiyaka. What? Why does that sound familiar? No, I did shove a bunch of data, you know, <laughs> straight into my head. Ah, uh, Nakayama, right. The weirdo that was obsessed with me. The other weirdo that was obsessed with me. <laughs> I'm not obsessed. Oh, man. Hyperion would kill to get their hands on this. This? You! Your head or body or whatever Jack is in. Yeah, they would, wouldn't they? Whatever version of Jack you've got in there, Nakayama stored it for a reason. We don't tell anyone. Not at least until we what? figure no, out. No, what no, we no, 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 no. You need to get me back yeah, to Helios. You're probably right. No, no, you are definitely wrong. This is torture. That's that's what it is. I'm in hell. This is what hell is. <laughs> it's a 
about time. That's gotta be Yvette. I'm tired of walking. That makes two of us. Uh-oh! Incoming! <laughs> it's coming right for us. Hey, I guess that tracker's working, huh, boys? It's coming right <laughs> for us! Go to Papa! <laughs> nice sock. Fancy meeting you two here. Here I was, out for a nice drive, and I land right on just the guys I was looking for. So, I'm guessing Yvette's it. What? No way! Ho ho ho! That girl you keep calling, thinking no one's noticing? No, no need. You're Hyperion property, Reese. Hyperion doesn't lose track of its property. Look, I know we had a deal. Well, I don't like to go back on an agreement made man to man. Hey, that's I... right, we did have a deal. You convinced me to double cross my best friend, and the day isn't even over before you're double crossing me? Oh, <laughs> oh man, when you put it like that, it does sound awful. Wow, man, just <sighs> wow. Should have known better than to trust a snake like you. Don't be like that, little guy. It's just the way of the, uh... Listen, I'm gonna go see if I got a shirt in the trunk, because your body is making me uncomfortable. Hold tight, kids. Look! I told him I would sell you out, but I swear I wasn't gonna do it. I was just saying whatever he wanted to hear just to keep the jerk off our backs. I wasn't gonna follow through with it. Please believe me. I swear, Reese. He offered me the deal, too. Really? What did you tell him? What's that? They're shovels, genius. You two freaks start digging. I want to see a decent grave going before too long. You heard me. Don't make me tell you again. No, no, no. I'm not digging. How about I gut shot you? Your little friend can watch you bleed out. I do not want to do that. What a good friend. What part of dig don't you understand? Let's get going, Mr. Universe. Okay, just don't shoot. Ugh. There you go, a little hard. <laughs> to be fair, that was supposed to hit you. Wait. Ugh. Wait! <laughs> oh. oh. Ah, oh, damn, damn that smarts. I think I did that wrong. I, I got a tough noggin. Looks so easy in the movies, but amateur hour. You gotta aim for the bridge of the nose, dum dum. How is it every time I show up, you idiots are in a worse situation? <laughs> You're not helping. <sighs> All right, fun's over. Looks like we'll be settling for the shallow variety of grave. Reese, you die first, and then he can load your body in the car. I'll bury Vaughn myself. What? Yeah, they want this idiot's body for something up there. Something, uh, important floating around in his head. This is a prototype. The most advanced gun Hyperion has ever made. Someone's overcompensating. Any last words before the, what is it, with the 
Inevitable. You don't even know how to use that thing. Maybe you should have read the manual, huh? Manuals are for amateurs. Damn it! Uh, is there a problem? Yeah, I know how to shoot a gun. I just want to get the maximum damage out of this thing. Okay, look, as much as I'd love to watch this idiot kill you two idiots, I can't let that happen. I'm, I'm inside of, I'm not inside you, but I'm like, look, if you go, I go. I've enhanced your Echo Eye, so use it to hack something and get us the hell out of this jam. Figure out how you can pay me back later. I've got you back. Right. Okay, mess this guy up. System access, that's new. But not a gun, even do. Push this in. Push this in, and nothing's happening. Something feels locked. Where's the safety on this fucker? No, What's wrong with this thing? The safety? I don't even. Okay, we got power. Shut What are you doing with your hands? Uh, uh, I'm, I'm not doing that. Oh, hello. <laughs> this is an interesting little development. Fine, look, we gotta go. This is my head. Get out! Come on, don't be like that. Oh, oh you see, you see what you did. You see, you just... Race! Yeah, go ahead and run. You're just making this butter for me. I missed you more! This isn't over! You hear me? You hear me? Hey! So, should we be going to Hollow Point or straight to Old Haven? I mean, they know where we're going! Maybe we should just meet them there! Well, I guess we could just meet him in Old Haven, you know, get a head start, or we could always just go to Hollow Point, though that might be dangerous. Man, this is a big decision. <laughs> it's weird, but I, I always, uh, you know, talk to myself during, you know, we'll meet them at Hollow Point, then we'll go together, like a family. Sounds good. To Hollow Point. Okay, I'm sorry! It was just to keep Vasquez off of us! Like I said, I would never betray you, bro! Do you forgive me? Just say yes! Because I feel like super bad right now, bro! Even though I wasn't gonna go through with it. It's good, bro! Really? Yeah, bro, don't sweat it, we're good! Oh, bro, thanks, bro! No problem, bro, bro! Thanks, bro. Hey, we're bros, bro. That's bro, bro. Bro! For bro. Bro, bro. Bro, 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 are you done? Bro, 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 bro. <laughs> Unbelievable! I got one.
We should probably let him finish. Fine. I'm curious. Why would you choose to go to Hollow Point? What was there to gain? I'm growing impatient. Hey, I've been to enough Hyperion management workshops to know you never get in the way of worker bees doing the work for you. Yeah, what you do instead is come in at the last minute and ruin everything. We all have our reasons. I suppose yours are good enough. If they were, we wouldn't be here. A man can only take so much. Luckily, you're a safe distance from a man. <laughs> We were stranded in the desert. You had a car. Did you even consider coming to get us? We had our own... One of you will have to change a tire. Graveyard. I hate to say it, but they're not gonna last the night. Yeah, that's what I kind of thought. Between the exposure, the skags, and the psychos, I'd say they're screwed. They knew what they signed up for. With a caravan like this, we couldn't help them if we wanted to. Exactly rolling in cash right now. How are you gonna get him to do it? I mean, I'm assuming it's not exactly a charity. And we definitely cannot get out of here if we don't get this fixed. I'll just play it by ear. Duck and weave, go with the flow. Uh-huh. We'll figure it out, don't worry. Stay here. I'll do the talking. Wouldn't have it any other way. Every mechanic have to be gross. Scooter's a fan of the races. Good to know. That race was insane. Rest in peace, Bossanova. Leaving me out like this. I almost feel sorry for the poor sap. Almost. Alright, carry the three to five by twelve. Oh, uh, what the hell, man? I gotta cut down my wrench budget. Uh, oh, hey, man! Welcome to Skitter's Catch a Ride! What can we do for you today? <laughs> Uh... Sorry if I seem a little dis distracted. Uh, hopefully handing this place over to the new proprietor today and I gotta get all these numbers and stuff in order. No, it's a lot. I don't know if you know this, but the transition from small business owner to franchise owner is surprisingly difficult. Haven't seen this much paperwork since... Wait, new proprietor? Yeah, man, I got too many locations now. I can't work all of them. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah. Hoping to hand this old girl off to Jenny Springs, you know her? 
She used to fix buggies and crap on the moon, so I figured it'd be like riding a bike for her. Figuratively speaking, I don't really do bikes, <laughs> you know. Holy crap! I knew I recognized this rig from somewhere. You were in the latest Boston Over Death Rally. Oh, I was there, man! Did you see me? I was, I was waving! You were a badass! Oh, <laughs> yep, got me. That thing's beat up to hell and back, man. I could fix it, but it's probably gonna run you about 2,500 cold 2,500? Uh, that's a little out of my price range. Not to be implied or nothing, but you must have won a buttload of money from that race, right? Where'd it all go? Oh, cause my cousin, right? He said that his sister's friend's neighbor's husband won one of them races one time, and the cats kept them fed for weeks. Of course, those days they were mostly, you, you know, the the money, but but still, it was weeks. Yeah, someone stole it. Can you believe that? Yes, actually, yes, I can. Well, tell me this. You think you could ever see yourself racing again? Let me pitch you something. And it might be crazy, but if you keep racing, I would love to endorse you as a sponsor. What do you say? It'll be great. Maybe like a billboard, a couple of commercials, product placement. Tell you what. Throw in an extra thousand bucks and you've got yourself a deal. Thousand? Wow, man, that's kind of a hard bargain, don't you think? Call it a signing bonus. Oh, I, I don't know, man. That kind of thing makes me... A little uncomfortable. Say it once for me, man, you know? The catchphrase? Catch a ride! You know it. Come on. Don't be shy. I'm your sponsor now. Gotta hear how you do the catchphrase. Catch a ride! Hmm. Okay, okay. A thousand bucks. It's yours, but you're gonna have to win, like, a crap load of races, alright? I'm made of money, man. I'm thinking that we put a big old ad on your van, you know, like maybe a picture of me with like, catch a ride up above it, you know, all cool, right? I'm looking all badass for you to put some badass pictures of you with your car and your hat and all that. Hi, Scooter, right? Everything going okay? <laughs> I was, uh, I was just gonna... You know, go grab the paperwork, let me take care of that. Okay, bye. Alright, man, here's my standard endorsement contract. Don't mind the sub clauses about uh, explosions or whatnot. I might have copied it from Torg. Anyway, I figure as long as I'm in there and you're yeah, doing it for free, maybe you want to splurge and get some of the special packages. I got some good ones. And don't tell me you're broke, because I know you've got that extra thousand I just gave you. I know it's a big decision. You go ahead and take your time. A lot of good choices, I know, I know. Real classy ones, too. Sometimes I just stand here and, and stare at them, you know? I know how it is. That one would look badass as hell, man. Take it from me, the badass from hell. What the hell? Let's go for the whole nine yards. Come on in, man. We'll get her all hooked up and get to work. Oh, crap. This doesn't look good. Hey, fellas, what can I do you for? Oh, no. I just hope that little deal you two struck is enough to get him to look the other way. Scooter won't turn us in. You don't know that. We don't even know what the reward is this time. You just gotta have some faith, Sasha. Though, maybe pressing in for that extra cash wasn't the greatest idea. Uh, 
Out of Tatum. Hope you ladies weren't too scared. Just doing my duty to keep ruffians the crap out of my garage. I'm a real protector type. Thanks. Hi, hey man. It was no big deal. Proper man ain't gotta turn in two nice seeming ladies. You might be murderers or some crap, but you ain't tried to murder me yet. <laughs> but seriously, please don't try to murder me. Seems like there's some bad men looking for you two, though. You got a place to lay low while I'm getting your ride all fixed up? I don't think Felix is as too far away. If we're careful, we can make it on foot. Then, let's do it. We shouldn't hang around here too long. Looks like he had company while he was away. Hopefully they didn't find the stash. Come on, look around. We gotta be in and out. Yeah. I got the door. Always nice to see an old friend. Great, a flashlight. Maybe if we go camping. It's a black light. It's the one Felix used to check our first counterfeit bills. Oh, it looked familiar. It's hard to believe that asshole would be sentimental enough to keep this in his safe. Not unless he meant for us to find it. What's that? A grenade? Yeah, looks like another one of Felix's homemade projects. Well, let's take it. Felix sure was into science fiction. Always a better shot than me. Man, it used to drive me crazy. That was a long time ago. Felix's favorite chair. Those few times he felt he could relax anyways. A comfort directly proportional to its wear. Who is she? I don't know. They look happy though. I had to force this on him once his eyesight was starting to go. Yeah, stubborn as always. I couldn't even get him to stop using floppy disks. He always complained about the reception on this thing. Right. A phonograph is more to his taste. Sasha, look at this. What the hell? It's ultraviolet paint. 
I guess he wanted to keep all this a secret. Well, he left this for us to find, so... There's something he wanted us to see. There we go. He left something for us to find. Just like him to make a children's game out of something like this. He never could see us as adults. Well, maybe that was the problem. Yeah, sis? What are the chances those Hyperion boys aren't dead already? Hyperions are resilient. They'll be fine. Too many memories in this place. Let's hope there's a bit more than that. I hope that bumpkin can put our ride back together. The caravan has seen some better days. Maybe the upgrades will make it feel new. Hmm, maybe. The message seems so vague. We're not seeing the whole picture. Keep looking, we're bound to find something. I can't believe we're leaving Hollow Point. It's a town full of losers, Fee. Nothing left for us here. We better keep at it. Yeah, I'll let you know if I find anything. What is it? What's your dream destination for when all this is over? Everywhere's a dream if you've got the ends to make it so. Even Hollow Point? Okay, fine. Everywhere but Hollow Point. The message seems so vague. We're not seeing the whole picture. Keep looking. We're bound to find something. We better keep at it. Yeah. I'll let you know if I find anything. It's like he's taunting us. What are you pointing us at, Felix? Who is she? I don't know. They look happy, though. See it! Right there! Awesome! Is this the right spot? Yep. Just gotta pry it open. If you find another flashlight under there, I'm leaving. Guess that's what we're searching for, huh? Guess so. Here we go. Better double check the contents. Sexy, you're coming with me. What is it? It's an echo comp. Why is there? If you're seeing this, I suppose I'm either dead or worse. My plan worked. I'm sorry. Fiona, Sasha, 
There's so much I want to tell you, but the less you know, the better. Oh, give me a break. Halfway through the con, I realized we were messing with Valerie's people. I knew that, and I never revealed it to you two. Well, if you're watching this, it won't be long before she's coming after you. Change your names. Change your appearance. Change your life. I believe him. I believe Take he was protecting us. And go. Forget about the life you had. And forget about me. But know that I love you both. With all my heart. <laughs> You know, it's okay to be mad, Sasha. Good! Cause I am! I'm not gonna listen to another second of his bullshit! I can't believe you let him live! To be fair, I did shoot him. I wish I had that chance. I wish you hadn't shot him! Really? I wanted to take him out myself. It was always about the money. The second a big score showed up, he betrayed us. We had it. We had it in our hands, Fiona. Ten million dollars. Enough to get off this planet, enough to... to buy a new life. Felix may be gone, but I'm still here for you. I know. First we find that vault. After that, the rest will take care of itself. Oh, I hope you're right. You want a sandwich? It might be a while before we eat again. Sure. Huh. Wonder what's in this. What is it? It's some sort of an upgrade. Still only holds a single shot, but it looks like it adds an elemental effect to the bullet. A parting gift. Good thing this comes with another shot. I used my last one on Felix. He left you something, too. I don't want it. So... you're saying I can have it? I don't care what you do with it, I just know I don't want it. I'll just hold on to it for you. In case you change your mind. I won't. So stubborn. You really gonna turn down a dead man's final gift to you? Cold-blooded. Right. You should be ashamed of yourself. Hands up, both of them. What you making? Nice hair. What's that supposed to mean? It means your hair is nice. I will shoot you in the face right now if you're talking oh, shit! Vince, calm down, man. Don't talk about his hair, all right? All right. He's good. Heard me going up. 
You see me looking at you. Make him shoot through that nice floor. And for what? For nothing. You two got every bounty hunter in Pandora looking for you. And you're making a sandwich? Tyra, let's get out of here. Ooh! She's fast. Please. You embarrassing yourself. Go on. Fiona, shoot him! Do it. You're pointing that at a dude who has people shoot him in the chest for fun. I'm usually drunk. You all right, man? Oh, yeah. Real, real good. I <laughs> love You don't have to be a tough guy about it. It's cool. Hey, man. Hey! Go! Oh, I'm counting these bullets. And they come in... It's my story. Shut up. Is she still back there? I can't see her. Are you sure? Maybe she's on the rooftop. She must... Ah, look out! Sasha! Oh, 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 oh. This ends now. Motorbots gonna stop. Wait, that doesn't sound right. Motorbots can't do Look, that. Look, were you there? No, you weren't. That's what happened. Go on. Was she bothering you? Yeah, you probably should have asked that before you threw her halfway across town. Oh, man. Did you see the look on her face? Oh, Athena's gonna be so pissed. <laughs> I don't think she expected that. Come with me if you want to leave.
I told you Hyperion some bitches want back. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. I promise. That's our ride. Like hell, man. I know the woman that dropped this van off, and you sure as crap ain't them. Well, okay, not our ride, but... Being a Hyperion would just strike one, man. Now you're lying to me in my garage. That's like four or five more strikes right there. Are you guys trying to steal our van again? Ha! I knew it! Oh my god, can you please explain to this guy that we're friends? No way these girls are associated with no Hyperion D-bags! Oh, okay, come on. We're not douchebags. Friends is a little much. I'd call it what it is. Which is? A temporary alliance. Oh, that really hits the heart. I appreciate that, Fiona. These are my temporary allies. Can I get in the damn van, please? All right, well, if you say they're with you, I guess I can believe that, man. But if you ladies get in trouble, you just call, all right? Or, you know, you don't have to be in trouble to call, man. If you just want to chit-chat, or you find a restaurant you really like, or, you know, wait, but, but the trouble thing, that's you, that's you. Thanks for everything, seriously. The caravan looks fantastic. You do amazing work. Oh, yeah, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Catch a rise if you need anything. I got them popping up all over Pandora. There are no more bandits. Bandits? Eh, they haven't lived here for years. The Crimson Lance massacred them. Some say their corpses still roam the streets seeking vengeance. Sasha. Not to be a downer, but I'm not seeing any Atlas facility. I'm mostly seeing dry trash. Would it be so hard for just once something to go according to plan? Enough of this standing around crap. Let's get moving. All right, guys. Sure, it's not a fancy resort town, but we're not here for a day at the spa. We're looking for a top secret military facility. Don't worry. We'll figure this out. Pretty sure. I can figure this out. to something.
you guys. Guys, come check this out. It's like the whole grid leads right to here. I mean, with all these power lines everywhere, they've, they've got to be connected to something, right? something hey that sounds good right good sound you keep hacking I'll go check on Loderbot hey pal yo how you holding up there man all things considered I'm actually not terrible that's great. I mean, for, for you, that's that's great. Thanks for that. So, what do you think's actually inside a vault? I don't know. I mean, maybe it's like, whatever you say you want suddenly appears. Yeah, but what if right when you get your wish, you like trip on a rock and you're like, oh crap. Okay, my wish is to not go into a vault with you. This place is a nightmare. Could be worse. There could be zombie bandits hiding in the shadows. Yeah, I guess there's that. Don't say anything. I don't tell you often enough, bro, but thanks for your help. You're welcome, man. You're the best, man. I, I mean that. Stop! Talk to you later, man. You know where to find me. Couldn't have left me a ladder, could you? Typical Atlas. Hey, guys. Hey. That's a nice sock. Oh, really? I mean, because, you know, a, a good pair of socks is an often overlooked detail of a gentleman's wardrobe. I'll try and remember that. Yeah, so... You want your boot back? I would love my boot back, yes. Don't say I never gave you anything. Thanks. You're a lifesaver. So, what did happen back there with, um... You know, the... Why do you ask? No. Oh, sorry, it's, it's... It's none of my business. He got greedy. That's all there is to it. Well, any ideas about how to get in? No, oh, I thought you Hyperians had an answer for everything. Cool, thanks for the help. Don't mention it. I won't. Like, ever. I literally won't ever mention it. Ever. All right, well, um, I'm gonna get back to it. We'll be here. Another one. No, oh, couldn't have left me a ladder, could you? Typical Atlas. <laughs> the 
grounds different between here and here? Okay, let's see what that does. About all doll was good for, am I right? <laughs> Ew. 
Ew, gross. There the whole time? And that must be our facility. Underground hidden doors! <laughs> Atlas, man. So what's next? Well, clearly we go in. Whoa, whoa, easy! Watch where you point that thing. All right, everyone, here's the plan. The key to this is stealth. We stay low to the ground. We don't... I wish you guys would stop doing that. like we're in the right place. Well, that's ominous. This is a massacre. Crimson Lance, these guys are serious badasses. Watch your step. Whole place could be booby-trapped. If this place is as valuable as we think it is, they might be trying to protect it. What the hell did this? Not what. Who? This is Athena's handiwork. I'm starting to think we might have just gotten lucky with her back there. Whoa. Mr. Ten Million Dollars. Reese and Vaughn's new little playmates, right? It's very good to meet the two of you. It's a shame we couldn't be meeting under different circumstances. Vaughn, Reese, you didn't think I'd have August handling all my dirty work, did you? There are some things a man just doesn't solve. Oh, Motorbot, attack! I'm helping! Uh-huh. Come on, guys. You didn't think I'd come all the way down here before grabbing a universal remote, did you? What? The Gordis Project, the two halves of the core, everything leading to a vault. We got it all. Checkmate, amigos. I am shame. <laughs> What'd you think, Reese? That you could pilfer something from my toy box, no strings attached? You never could follow through. That's your problem. And that's why I beat you every time. Come on, Vasquez. Isn't this all beneath you? Coming down to Pandora, working with these guys? Wow, Reese. You know, I 
I never looked at it that way before. I don't take advice from janitors. Oh, you guys do not believe the dream I just had. Holy crap. Wait, 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 wait. What, what, what the hell is this? Didn't I just do this with this guy? Kiddo, I admire your consistency, but, uh... God. Oh, and who is this princess? Wait, they... <laughs> Son of a... Shock other people. Oh, yes. I knew about that. Um, don't touch the cores, I guess. Thanks for the heads up. <sighs> Jackass. They're gonna have to do it for us. You'll cooperate, right? Because I figure if you don't, well, I... I can think of all sorts of things to do to your little friends. Yeah. Like, we're just gonna give this gorgeous thing to two scumbags like you. <laughs> it's cute you think you have a choice. Two always, two halves. I'll uh, take my soon-to-be-dead janitor here. You take Miss Fancy Hat down the other one. Boys, you keep an eye on these two. Especially this one. Don't believe a thing she says. Oh, how sweet. Yeah, you sit tight. Get your hands off me! Either of those two move, you shoot them where they stand. Race, I'll admit it, you and uh, Vaughn have impressed me. And that sort of thing doesn't happen often. I'm surprised you've made it this far. I uh, Hugo Vasquez, Hugo... There's, there's something I remember about this guy. What the hell really? is it? Really? It's unbelievable. He must have had some sort of help. Couple of desk jockeys like you. I'd say it was 50-50 it survived the landing. My friends are out there. Okay, they're the reason. We actually... Oh, we actually make a good team. Oh, that's sweet. And now you're all gonna die together. <laughs> I guess so. Bummer. Just when you were making friends. I mean, you might think of me as a self-made man, and for the most part, you'd be right. But there was this time when I looked up and admired one man in particular. The most impressive person He's I've gonna ever say known. me. Handsome Jack. You idiots always say me. Still can't figure out who he is, though. We had the special report. He would do this thing where he would punch me in the face whenever he'd see me. It didn't matter if he was busy. He always made time for me. No, still nothing. I punched my mom, for Christ's sake. Just boom, right in the kisser. I was drinking from a mug when he got me one time. I hate to break it to you, Vasquez, but what you're describing is... You don't is... get it. You, you don't get it. You don't. The point is, I was his punching bag. Oh, man. He thought we were exclusive. That's adorable. I miss our time together. Ah, this drives me crazy. It's right there. It's on its point. But through me... His legacy carries on. <coughs> I want you to know, this isn't personal. This is all about damage control at this point. We cut my boss, Valerie, out of the first deal. Hmm. Obviously, that was a bad idea for a lot of reasons. The fact that the vault key was bullshit being first and foremost. Well, Valerie found out about it, so now we've got to convince her that whatever comes out of this room is worth more than the $10 million deal we tried to slip under her nose. Then, hopefully, she doesn't kill us all. She ever talk about me? What? Sasha, did she ever talk about me? You guys are sisters. I figure you talk every now and again. Oh yeah, all the time. Really? <laughs> yeah, she can't stop talking about how much of a moron you are. You're funny. Look, I just want you to know, as far as you and I are concerned, there's no hard feelings. That is so generous of you. I'll think about that when you shoot me in the back. 
Come on, don't be like that. You're the one that hustled me, remember? And that, you see, is what I was trying to provide for you. Some guidance, some mentorship, a father figure. I was trying to help you. The janitor gig, it was to test your mettle, your resolve. And I gotta say, you reacted with some balls, kid. Some big old balls. You see, Reese, I started at the bottom, and I worked my way up. I, uh... <laughs> I used to be in the mailroom. Whoa, wait a minute. Wallet head! That's where Jack found me. <laughs> he used to be bald and he was going through these hair implants and, and, and I, it would stick money to his head. It was, <laughs> it was hilarious. Uh, but it was a long time ago. A ask him about it. He'll tell you. Ask him about it. <laughs> go on. Go on, seriously. But that's ask a pretty him. big difference. Listen, uh, wallet head. Well, Wallet head? <laughs> yeah, so uh, I appreciate the advice. I, I, I do. But I'd much rather you take your two cents and shove them into your wallet that you have on the back of your head that you are ashamed of because you are a wallet head. I. I was trying to be nice to you. <laughs> Let's get this over with. Oh, that's good. Oh, when that's I take your right. corpse Thank back you. up to Helios, I'm gonna make sure they save me some of your skin to make a wall out of. Whenever I see it, I'll remember the look on your face at this moment. Whoa. That's legitimately creepy. I can't tell you how much I'm looking forward to getting back to Helios. No! Hey! Hey! I just... I just need some reassurances. That it was just about the money and nothing else. And relationships have to be built on trust. I don't know if I can take Sasha back without it. How do you even start a conversation like that? At this point, I assume she's just... Embarrassed. We're con artists, August. It was all fake. The way you met, how you fell for each other, how the deal came together. All choreographed. You were conned. It wasn't real. So you're saying I shouldn't take her back? Hey, we all make mistakes. I've certainly made my fair share. Who am I to judge? Well, here we are. Go on. Stalling won't do you any good. Stalling? Whoa. Hey, what is this? No. No, 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 no! chat? I <laughs> can't imagine he's too happy with you guys. Uh, at least that's the vibe I was getting. I guess Sasha left an impression on him. Yeah, I could see that. What do you mean? Yeah, what? Uh, no, nothing. No, nothing. Gortis unit ready for assembly. We got it! We got it! I guess that's our cue. Pushing! 
exactly do you think I'm doing? that? That is a metal ball. How's this gonna get us into a vault? Hmm. Maybe it's some sort of vault key. It doesn't look like any vault key I've seen. Oh please, the only vault key you've seen was the fake one you tried to sell me. This is true. and let's go. Everything is okay. 